of nothing? Artyom, the only thing I can hear is that Geiger counter ticking. Why, <sighs> uh, yes. And there's also those damn things. Calling all the time. Let's go home, dear, please. Don't you think I'd also love to live on an ocean beach or in a green forest? But what good are these fantasies in a silent world? Silent, Artyom? Because it's dead. We took our time. Time to replace our filters. Move it. We don't need any extra radiation, darling. <sighs> Father will kill me if he finds out I went up with you. Twice if he learns we've been to a Hansa off-limit zone. Have you been to all these ruins? <sighs> See all the destruction. And Moscow had the best anti-air defenses in the country. If this is how it looks now, imagine how the rest of the world looks. should come back to the order. We'll move to Polis. Dad says he'll arrange a flat for us. Because if not us, then who? A flat with a kitchen and a shower. Let's go in turns here. It's not stable enough. At least it held. Well, I'd say we're out of the woods. Whoa! Hear that? A draw. We're lucky the mutants hate each other as much as they hate us. Stop. The pack is here. So, do we turn this place into Thermopylae, or do we let them pass? I really don't get why this zone is off limits to stalkers. The radiation and beasts are nothing special. Wait it out. Looks like that was all of them. I'm glad they didn't notice us. That was a large pack. Oh, is this why the zone is off limits? I mean, if all the packs here are like that. Damn, 
Damn, too high. Hey, Artyom, help me get up there. You should have checked first, assholes! Artyom, thank God. These people, they're Hansa, not the Order. Assholes. They did a number on you. Well, Dad will rip them a new one for that. What's going on in this Moscow of yours, anyways? Of yours? You're putting this like you're not from here. We aren't. Our village is about 200 kilometers from here. What village? You're not from Moscow? Just a regular village. We came here to find the boy's father. Left for Moscow about a year ago and never came back. But then we got caught by this here. You mean there's life outside? Why wouldn't there be any? Sure, there are lots of bad places and lots of beasts around, but we still get by. Artyom, you're right. People really do live out there. We didn't know. We thought we were the only survivors. God, we'll tell the whole metro about this. The heck and the boy out! Hey, you people drove us halfway to nowhere. They can handle it. At least give them their masks back.
damn watchman broke through. Ugh. The workers are done for. Keep your weapon trained from the opening. If anything comes through, shoot. Sure. Sure. Send a group there to seal the exit and pick up the remains. Attention! The turntable is switching on. Shut up. Now listen, if you come out of here, we won't accept this shit again, okay? to the base chief for interrogation. I can't take you to the main entrance. Too many guards. But we may sneak in from the back. Let's go. Don't rush, though. If they notice you, we've both done for. Wait. You'd better not walk into the light. Let's do it this way. You sneak to the lighting panel and disable it while I distract them. Sergeant. Sanya, go tell the workers. Don't rush. Oh, you turned quite Crouch. Hey, don't make mind. noise. So you can use your head after all. <laughs> Stay close to the wall. Yermak, is that you? What are you mumbling? Come here and help me fix this. Yes, sir. Got me already. Come on, come on. Fixing this should be nothing for you. Quietly.
go through. Come on. Good luck to you. This system supplies air for the command center. It's not that large, actually. Wait for the moment. I will, of course, do it again, but I'm not much of a fighter as you could guess. Sitting there. We must get out before they recover. Get ready, people. Guards! You have to go sneak through the courtyard. Take the door the guards are coming through. Here, quick! Let's go! Oh, I'm not very cool. Who are you? Andre Ivanovich Yermak, the train engineer. Run now! Just get to that hangar and then God willing, I'll get you out of here. Take the way, so I'll get there easily. Why are you helping us, Andrei Ivanovich? I had... Uh, uh, I guess I'll tell you later. I hope. Uh, hey guys, be careful. What's going on? Hey. Hey, hey. Artyom, I see the enemy. <sighs> Give me a boost. Can't really see well with the snowstorm. Don't forget your visibility gauge, Atyom. If you don't move too fast and don't come out into the light, you'll be harder for them to notice. Don't turn your flashlight on either, they could notice. Atyom, incoming two of them. I'll give you some cover from above. Do you remember the time they had a shot for the presentation? Did not want to cover the 
Attention! The command center came under enemy attack. The attackers are assumed to still be on the base territory. Artyom, I'm changing positions. All unauthorized persons are to be fired upon immediately. Civilian personnel movement is prohibited until further notice. Attention! The jamming system is coming back online. Well done. You're almost at the hangar. Sailing from here. Great job, Artyom. Way inside. You can take the mask off, Artyom. Watchmen just have a nice meal and we don't have to worry. <laughs> if you say so. Still, this is suspicious. You do your thing and I'll just stay here, just in case. Am I glad to see you here? Are you all right? I'm fine, thank you. All right. We don't have much time. We'll be back. I'll go to the engine. It should be ready now. You go up there and Come switch on, the Tim. turntable mechanism on. And please, be careful. We could easily have the whole base on us.
legislation dictates they'd be killed. In any case, I have to get them out of town until it all blows over. But you all should stay. Hear me, Major? My people are in no way related to this not my this call, and you know misunderstanding. Well, I'll channel. fight for the guys no matter what. Of course, Artyom, Anna, they are the with us. The no one behind. Alright, Spartans, throw these overboard and pull steam ahead. Come with me, Artyom. Let's catch them there. I'm so glad the boys supported us. 
It looks like my father didn't say a word to them about this either. We spent 20 years in Metro, thinking the rest of the world was burnt to a crisp in the war. But they just circled Moscow with those jammers, and we were none the wiser. How perfect of them! While you were getting irradiated on the surface, my father just kept lying! Lying to you, to me, to everyone! The whole fucking world! And not even batting an eye! Uh! Hold on! 
Now we are not just traitors. We are honest-to-God enemy saboteurs. <laughs>